Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to be doing two separate paintings and I'm going to be using a new paint for me. It is the Chroma Molten Metal Metallic Paint and I'm going to be using a gadget. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right in. Okay guys, so you can see my little gadget here. It is a mini leaf blower. Uh, I saw this on Canela's um, channel. She used it once, so I will put her link in my description. Um, it's pretty cool. I've tried a couple practice ones already and they worked out really good. Um, it does need, it has a cord, so it does need a charging block. Um, but it is quite powerful for just this little, little gadget. All right, so I am going to now do a little prep work. I'm going to get my gloves on and then I will be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. I've got my gloves on and I coated my canvas with black paint. Um, this is a 9 by 12 canvas. And um, I just wanted to let you guys know, I forgot to tell you before, that this has to stay plugged in the whole time you're using it. Um, it seems like when you think about it, it might be a little pain because of the cord, but it's really not that big of a deal. The button is right here and the cord kind of stays out of the way. So not that big of a deal. All right, so I am gonna go ahead and um, jump right in here, get the paint poured. And this is the first color I'm gonna use and it is copper and I'm just pouring it down the middle. Okay. The next one here is aged bronze. And this one is called Dorado Gold. It's a really, really pretty soft gold. And then I also have another gold. It's called Xanadu Gold. Okay. All right, so here we go.
guys so both of these paintings are dry and I love the results that I got from these chroma molten um, metal metallics uh, the colors are nice and vibrant and they dry really nice as well. I did get a little bit of different results with this one because I added the deco art um, metallic paint and that deco art really has a mind of its own, their metallic line. So I did get um, some awesome detail in that one. And um, the other one looks beautiful as well. Uh, the colors blended really good and um, I really like the way that one turned out. And I wanted to let you guys know because these are like a, a Dutch port-ish uh, style. And I had a subscriber a couple um, times let me know that this was similar to what they were calling a paint, paint bombing, which um, was from Paul Start Art. So go check his stuff out. It's really cool. He's been doing it actually for quite a while. Okay, so hopefully you guys like these. If you do, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, you can go ahead and give it a thumbs down. But I heard that every time there's a thumbs down, a kitten dies. True story. So please choose wisely. All right, and don't forget to subscribe as well and have a great day.